In today's video, we're going to be looking at this tool called Outrank, right? So this is another AI SEO writing tool. So the cool thing about this one is actually it does a lot of the keyword research for you and this content planner. So when you sign up for this tool, and I'll leave a link down in the first comment, uh, if you want to sign up there, that would be great. It's an affiliate link, so I would earn a commission if you do decide. We'll go into all that now in a second, but let's look at the tool first to see if this is right for you. So basically, I had to fill in some uh, form, some you know basic information about my website and stuff like that. Take the time to do that correctly. It is, it'll take you 10 minutes, okay? totally worth it because at this point now the tool has you know generated all the keywords so it did all of this for me right so it's publishing one blog post per day right and you can see the information about it like so here's the first one first keyword that it came up with so i did my website which is my personal website connormartin.com right so we've got some volume here some difficulty and yeah so i talk a little bit about seo and uh, you know make money online all that stuff so basically it's done a lot of the keywords that yeah i'm quite interested in to be honest uh, so i'm really happy with the the keywords i probably would have done a lot of this like to be honest i haven't done uh, any of these articles so quite happy that it didn't actually go through some of the things i've already done which is excellent so you can see there's 30 articles already um scheduled out for me right so you can also change this as well like i can see some of them aren't very good like i don't really want that one that's not going to be helpful for me so i'll just uh cancel that one sorry so i'll get rid of that one right i don't want that one so you just get rid of that one that's cool um and one of the things is like how it works i really think this is amazing to be honest i was thinking about creating a tool similar to this and this is actually done it in a better way than i even i planned because the scheduler hadn't really planned it that part but if you look at this you know i've done a lot of seo and you know so many websites i do this all day every day so pretty cool the way this works to be honest is like finding you know the keywords that are selected the system works on search volume okay so things that are you know has search volume keyword difficulty right you want to have low keyword difficulty right relevance to your target audience long-term keywords right super super important right and then it's just article generated and published every day right so that is really really good i really appreciate that and so you can also like add keywords here so let's say ai seo that would be you know definitely something that i'd be looking for and i can just go to search there and then they have the keyword difficulty and the search volume right so you know you just search that one and go okay i want that one I'd like a few more keywords here, but anyway, that's fine. Uh, I can just add that, and then I think that gets added into the space that, yeah, I deleted. So really, really cool. But the big question, is the actual article any good? Let's have a look at the article. So yeah, we have our featured image here, and I've integrated it to my website. So I just set it to publish straight away. So I can just, you know, I don't even have to do anything, just one article per day. So that's really who this tool is for right it's kind of a bit more expensive right it's like 99 dollars per month right so it's not for your average person right i think this is good for a business that's you know already making money and just doesn't have time for seo and this will just you know gradually consistently build your seo consistency is very hard for seo to just keep publishing these articles every day but let's have a look at the the article and yeah i'm quite impressed with this article i think it's a really good the only thing i'd say is like so the title here is 10 best seo competitor analysis tools so you know i'd expect a list of these tools it doesn't really do that it just kind of like okay this is you know the tool that i probably mentioned first when talking about competitor analysis would be href so you know you'd like to see that the writing is really good but you know i'd probably have number one ahrefs number two blah 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 and keep on going like that and um, but it hasn't done that I don't see that as you know you know it's not the worst thing in the world but you know if it is an actual this should be a listicle style article right with that one two three four and we haven't done this as more just your standard blog post right listicles do really really well in google nowadays so definitely still a style or format of article you want to include in your stuff so yeah, it's actually included a, a relevant video, right? I know this guy, Adam Enfro Enroy, Enfroy. Uh, so yeah, you know, good video to add there. And yeah, it's quite long. You've got, you know, images. I, I like the images, got like text, which you know, usually AI images struggle with. So they're obviously using a good one, good image generation tool. So yeah, you know, the high price 
you know, you want to get good quality if you're going to be paying this high price. And what I really like about it is the hands off, right? Just don't even have to do anything. You could literally just put this into your content planner, right? And then you have all, I would spend 10 minutes checking over these. Definitely. You know, maybe, maybe you just need to check these because like I, I this one was written about two or three times. So I don't want that one. So you just X off those ones that you don't want. Right. But a lot of the other ones, I probably wouldn't do this best books and SEO. That wouldn't be, you know, something that I would I would think to do. But you know, maybe if it's just it's going to do it for me, then you know I don't need to think about that. I like that. So yeah, affiliate marketing with social media again. That's not something I'd actually thought about. So it's actually giving me ideas that I hadn't even thought about. And I think about these ideas a lot. So that is really really good so if you do want to go back into the the forms that you filled in at the start you just need to go into the settings and you can change your competitors and all of that so basically what i'm saying with this tool is you know you can create 30 blog posts which is around what i would recommend with ai you know one po i i actually publish sometimes two to five blog posts but i've always been a high volume publisher i think even before ai i was publishing five to ten blog posts per day and that works like crazy for a while sometimes you do get smacked down by just over publishing right you do need to kind of you know pace yourself a little bit so 30 articles per month is a really good for most businesses number to aim for right so all you need to do is set it up for you know 10 minutes at the start and then probably 10 minutes a month and then your seo is done this is something that i really really agree with because seo is this kind of black box and people think it's like this secret hack and this you know whatever my strategy is you know focus on content is like content 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 links backlinks and other things are important but like you know content is the backbone if you're publishing content all the time then you're going to get traffic you know that's you know what people miss a lot of the time they think there's all these like little check boxes and things that you need to do but if you've got things set up right from the start and honestly it's not that difficult it's just there's a few little things you need to know uh, to get your website set up at the start and then you know publish 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 right it's only when your website has like thousands of website of pages you know at that point things can get started getting tricky or if you're like an enterprise or something like that then you know you have to do a lot of this technical seo and all of these things but you can rank on google and these uh, you know chat gpt search engines and, uh, and perplexity and all of that with just a simple blog post like this i mean they're not that simple to create i know that a lot of work goes into actually even using ai to create these things but for you it's pretty simple right so it would just be 10 minutes per month which is fantastic then you should spend the rest of your market time on videos and social media that's my opinion i think seo is one great marketing channel but it's just like something that you need to be just doing consistency consistently sorry so that's it for this video if you want to sign up uh, i'll leave a link down in the description and the first comment and thanks for watching i definitely recommend this tool see you soon